be around $400. So I urge the Honorable Speaker to take into account the fact that a currency is a function of two things. It's a relationship between your exports and your imports. And if, as is the current case right now, we've got a deficit in our current account, to every dollar of foreign currency that comes in as export <coughs> earnings, four dollars are going out as imports. The equation is not balanced. Secondly, Honorable Speaker, a currency is a function of confidence. There is no confidence in my brother, the esteemed yeah. Minister of Finance. There is no confidence in the Reserve Bank and Mr. John Panoneta Mangundu. <laughs> Zero confidence. This move could have had the chance if we were going to shut the, the Reserve Bank and chase away John Panoneta Mangundu. You know him. I know it will not work. So I suggest to my learned friend, my esteemed friend, uh, Mr. Speaker, that do the right thing. Repeal 33 of 2019. Repeal 142 of 2019. Allow the two currencies to coexist. Let the market settle on the exchange rate. Encourage productivity, productivity, productivity. Eliminate export surrender requirements. Eliminate budget deficits and the rogue printing of money by the Reserve Bank. Honorable Speaker, I thank you very much.